Hello everyone, this is episode 3 of my Zero to Hero Solar Ranger playthrough. Um, we've had some great, great matches. The past 4 matches ended up getting us to level 4, so we're really close to our second perk, which we'll actually be able to grab one of these since we're running Spear as our first perk. We have basically a full kit at this point, minus a, a couple jewelry, which is kind of stopping us from getting that 15 strength threshold on the Ranger, which is really important to have a 0% physical power bonus, which allows us to do all the damage of our longbow. But regardless, we have a good kit. I'm really liking it. I do want to grab maybe one more stack of arrows. And then what we're gonna also do is buy a lot of room over here. So let's buy two more traps, put our potion there, and a bunch of heals to get us through the caves. We still got 268 extra gold. And let's get into it. Oh, I hear a wizard. I like this Ghost King tribute over here. My buddy pointed that out, but that's a cool little Easter egg over there. So the goal basically for this account is to hit level 15, and I would love to do some high roller troll bossing. So I've been practicing doing the troll boss on another account as a like naked ranger, trying to get my skills up as far as like, doing the the troll boss it's not really an easy boss to do um but it is definitely doable and i think we're getting close to being able to do that this is a pretty good spawn as well um we'll be able to clear up this room pretty quick missing my arrows already i haven't really made you too that happened last time we spawned here too i'm gonna kill this guy up here because i don't want that to happen i also hear the avenge sevenfold chasing after me hopefully i can I'd like to not take any damage here. There we go, perfect. It's a little, uh, a little funky there, but I also don't know why I grabbed that. Give me the chest. You know, I don't really see too many mimics in the goblin caves. Not, not nearly as many as you see in the crypts when you're playing with like, uh, you know, teammates and things like that. This will grab up. I don't really like these gold or these gray four square items they're not really very good as far as gold to square ratio um but while we don't have anything else i might as well take all the treasure i can right I'll reload my bow before we forget we are out of circle here so i'm gonna probably cross over here aggroed on something no, okay. Um, so let's jump right here. Let's get in kind of towards the middle room. Maybe we can kill a skelly champ in here. There's also... So here's stuff. He's probably going to troll boss. He's going the wrong way. I feel like I hear another person. above me that's fine extra one strength gloves are always good let's kill this thing real quick uh i really don't like these armored bugs they're scary especially when they fall all the way down there i wanted to trap that I'm dead. Good plays. Very good plays. The good old rogue got me there. Let's see what he had. He has my cloak now. Pretty good, man. He did me dirty there. I, you know, I saw, I thought it was a warlock, but it ended up being the rogue and he invised onto me, which I should have expected. I also should have used my biscuit way earlier and jumped down instead of trying to hit the triple shot, but he played that really well. He had a pretty good uh, dagger too. Is he running poison? He is running poison. So that dagger with the additional magic power, that is actually a really big 
build for a poison because that stacks with that magic damage. So he's essentially doing three additional magic damage per stab on me with the ambush rupture hide combo. He does a lot of damage. Good plays to him. Uh, we'll just run it back. So I do have some extra boots and some extra agility gloves, and I should be able to buy a longbow at this point, but I, let's see, do we have a, okay, we do have a gray spear, so I can run spear as well. So we'll do that, throw that stuff down, and let's buy some arrows. That isn't how I expected that first run to go, but uh, you kind of take them in stride, I suppose. Move all that, we'll grab one health pot, and then I'm gonna buy a couple bandages just to keep in the inventory. Bang, bang, boom, and we'll get into another one. I really feel like that last match can definitely show you how easy it is in this game to kind of catch a snowball, but then simultaneously lose it just as quickly. Um, so it's important to realize that you're not always going to get 100% wins all the time and to expect that is, is outrageous, you know? So making sure you have backups and like keeping the extra white gear that you might think is kind of dog crap but has okay rolls for your class, really important. Like on a ranger, you're going to want to hold any kind of one strength gloves, one strength uh, heavy leather leggings as those things, they help you hit that 15 strength threshold and do just so much more damage. It's honestly crazy what happens when you can hit level 50 or hit 15 strength. Uh, let's kill this armored bug. We are on the corner room. I'm pretty sure. No, this is not centipede room. The double bugging up, and I got a gabo on me. That's fine. Boink. Bane's attack. One, two. Very easy. The spear really makes clearing. I mean, cl clearing on a ranger is good as it is uh, because you can just kind of sit back. But if you don't want to sit there and shoot all your arrows, man, I love the spear for that. The spear is just really good. I think the spear also does really well in goblin caves because it's uh, mostly... See, we'll, we'll hold these for now. The spear is mostly stab attacks, uh, so you don't really hit your spear off the wall like you would with like a zwee hander or some of them other like bigger two-handed weapons uh, i definitely hear someone as well check out what's going on with this lion's head real quick the buff loot in the lion's head is definitely really good and you can find some good gear in here like uh one agi it's not amazing but what is that keep that just for sellables so i'm gonna do that do that through these real quick little inventory management and we are good to go uh let's cook back the other way kind of where we spawned um i don't okay i got an easy way up let's hit these chests wasn't sure if there was an easy way up so i didn't know that i wanted to hit these chests but there's also a player right to my left we're gonna get a little bit more agi here so we got a decent amount of agility stacked and we're kind of quick i'm gonna jump through here and see if i can find that player Sound like they were right over here. Something dead right there. Right here. Come, my fair sir. Let's fight. Are you ready? Fun duels only. Well, that wasn't very nice. This may not be a good fight shot. Okay, we'll, we'll beat him out here, watch. You won't be able to catch me because of my agility. His second wind is off now. And here's where we fight him. Good block. Ooh. Playing to my advantage here. Very nice. And we do gotta go. Could get a little dicey. should be good with that extra biscuit just get in out of the storm real quick and we're like right on the edge of the storm here so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna 
drop this. This is why campfires are really good, especially on Ranger with the higher resourcefulness. You're able to put these down really quick, so I don't have to use that last potion. Um, and I can get full health real quick. I should be able to... Okay, I can't do that now. Fun little fight. I enjoy a fair duel. Okay, I'm actually gonna toss those for now. Let's just make a little bit more room in the inventory. Do something like that. You can see as a ranger why it almost kind of sucks because you have to carry so many arrows. I definitely don't need this many arrows uh, currently, but just used to it from playing team fights. We may end up throwing some. I grabbed some off of that uh, ranger that I had killed in the beginning. So we're gonna triple shot this guy. Oh, missed. Uh, so I have two shots in the chamber. I believe these two shot now. Oh, only if you hit. Whoa! Wasn't expecting him to uh, tank so much. I do want to reload my bow quickly, just in case something happens. There's also still like three or four other players in the match right now. Let's see based on the amount of people that are still alive. Uh, I want that big chest. We're a goblin in the goblin caves, guys. Plus, we don't have to take any damage for this. Okay, there's the mimic that I was talking about. Love that. Please, no chump. Oh. That's some weird behavior. Why is he not attacking? Shadow mask. Uh, it's not for me. I don't care. We'll grab that though. See, there's a lot of greens that aren't for rangers. I see a lot of barbar. Oh, is that it? Oh, no. Unfortunate. No stack gray ranger gear. What's new? Is that it? So this has been cleared. Oh, they're below me. Hmm. I want to get down to them. Oh no, he died. No. The axeman killed that person. That's what that noise was. How do I want to get over there? I could jump down low, but then I gotta risk killing all them things. We also don't have a portal yet. All right, well, we'll do this. We're gonna jump low. I heard him die at this door. Yep, right here. And he was a ranger. Um. Get rid of that for now. I don't really need that. Um, take that extra potion. No gear. Okay, that's fine. Hopefully we can find a blue portal in here in a second. Rotate to the left on this. They can't hit you. Oh, I can't hit them. That's three dead. Second one right here. You can rotate to the right as well. Mm -hmm. I'm going to toss some arrows. Did I just see some movement? over there i thought i did oh it's just the skelly champ um let's kill the skelly champ so what i'm gonna do is kind of bait him over these uh traps as well to do the extra damage he does these wide swings here but you can dodge them fairly easy hopefully i don't pull this other uh insect here oh, that's not what i wanted to do it's okay though and take a couple extra hits. I still haven't seen my blue portal, so this is getting a little risky. Oh. Oh, we 
did aggro that as well. Okay, we don't have blue portals. Let's uh, see what he has. Uh, nothing very good for me. Only three portals have come up. I know that there was a change to the way blue portals work, but God, the only three is kind of crazy, right? Let's try to get up high here. Gonna do this quickly. There we go. And we'll, uh... We'll end it on that one. One more did just come up too, which is good. We would have been okay. A little bit of extra XP. Can't break that, can't break that. Okay. Not a bad redemption run. We got a full inventory of treasure, which is pretty nice. Let's see how much we ended out with. Uh, bing, bing. About 100 gold. Really not too bad for about 10, 15 minutes. We are a little bit under what we started off with, but you know, I'm only really missing that cape and the ring and some of that um, strength gear, but I do have a bunch of agility gear here, uh, which is pretty nice. Three additional agility is pretty good on a ranger. 23 makes me pretty quick. I'm also gonna vendor that really quick. And we have this. I don't really plan on trying to sell stuff on this account on the trading hall. Just doesn't really make sense to me. We'll keep that um, just as a backup melee. Sell this stuff. Extra 25 gold. Not bad. All right, guys. I really do appreciate you hanging out and watching these videos with me. We got a bunch of new uh, subscribers off of the last two videos. Bunch of views. I really do appreciate you guys. Some of you guys even made your way over on to my Twitch. And that is absolutely amazing as well. I do stream pretty much every evening on Twitch. It's twitch.tv slash guthttv. The link will be in the bio. Really appreciate you guys. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure you hit the like and consider becoming a subscriber. Thank you guys. I'll see you in the next one.